case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1969, the Louisiana Court of Appeal heard the case of Wilkie v. Cox, which centered on the legal rule that if someone purchases property through a tax sale and legally possesses it for 10 years, they can become the true owner, even if the tax sale was invalid. The dispute involved a property in Louisiana, with B.B. Wilkie and W.J. Colbert claiming ownership through a 1941 tax sale, while the heirs of George W. Cox claimed ownership through record title. The defendants argued that the tax sale was invalid, as the property had been adjudicated to the state and not redeemed before the tax sale. The plaintiffs countered that their ownership was acquired through a 10-year acquisitive prescription and could not be invalidated by the defendants. After a trial, the court confirmed the tax title and recognized Wilkie and Colbert as rightful owners. However, the original defendants appealed. The appellate court held that even an invalid tax deed can acquire indefeasible title through 10 years of prescription if the purchaser acted in good faith and possessed the property. Finding the plaintiff and Colbert to be eligible purchasers, the court applied LSA RS 9, 5803, confirmed their ownership, eliminated the invalid tax title, and assessed appeal costs to the defendant's appellants. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law, elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.